Hi, welcome back guys. Today I am back with another new video. In this video, I will discuss with very interesting lead code heart problem. So please watch this video at the end. You will learn lots of things. So let's start the video. First discuss with the question. Question is the write a SQL query to swap the employee department. Okay, I have one employee table. So employee table having entire data set having total three columns ID, name and departments. Okay, so I have to swap the employee department. Correct. So here you can see that my expected output is the so one uh, ID one name is John and department is the sale. Okay, so ID one name is John before uh, swapping department is the sale. So here we get the sale and after swap I will get the for ID two uh, department. Here you can see ID. Okay, so one becomes two two becomes one like that. So now go with employee ID three. So employee ID three Rohit department is the ID. So employee ID three the name is Rohit before swap ID after swapping is the marketing and for employee ID five ID five name Kabya department management for employee ID five name Kabya before swap management and after swap is the sale and as it is six also. Okay, but is the main trick is the last one is the only seven records are there. Eight record is not there. So I have to not swap this record. Okay, I have to swap one to six, but I will not swap in the seven records because I don't have the odd number, even number, sorry. Eight ID is not present in the data set. Right. So let's start the video how we can solve the problem. So here you can see that first I have to run the this my employee table okay so this is my entire data set having total seven records okay so i have to use first count function okay how I, i'll tell you why i have to use count function if i use count star so count star return me the total record but if i cannot use here count star be, because this is the aggregate function if i use count star i will get the error correct so i have to bypass this i have to find the total record i have to use over condition over and I have to use order by I will not give any order by not ID nothing so I have to use select null okay I have to select null I have to LESS total record total record so if I run this query I will get the total record so for this here you can see I will get the 777 for all the rows okay I have to make as this output as CTE with CTE as this output so I have to take select from CT okay so I need all the uh, all the columns and I have to use again case when statement I have to use case when statement I will tell you why I am using case when statement case when statement I have to check the first ID and total record is not same is not same and if id is the like uh, odd number so i have to increase that id okay so i have to use id not equal to total record so this condition is true id not equals to total record and i have to use again one more condition id modulus of 2 not equals to 0 so this condition also true because this one is the odd number so 1 modulus of 2 not equals to 0 so then what I do, I have to increase the ID, ID plus one, correct. So now go, go with the second condition. Now go with when ID not equals to two. And now go with the ID two, yani two, four condition, even condition. ID not equals to total record and, and I have to use ID modulus of two equals to zero. So this condition is true. 2 not equals to 7, 2 not equals to 7 and id modulus 2 equals to 0. So this condition also true. So if this condition is true, so I have to decrease the id. So id minus 1. So in that case id 1 becomes 2 and here you can see that 2 becomes 1. If this condition is match, otherwise I have one last condition, this condition. I have to take if this condition is not satisfied. So I will take the 7 as it is 7. So I have to take else id and as I have to give the column name as new id. New id. So if I run this CTE, I will get the. So here you can see the id 1 becomes 2, 
टू बिकम्स वन थ्री बिकम्स फोर फोर बिकम्स थ्री एज इट इज फाइव एंड सिक्स ऑल्सो सो यर यू कैन सी द फॉर एम्प्लॉय आई डी सेवन इज नॉट स्वैप सो सेवन एज इट इज सेवन ओके सो आई विल टेल यू सो आई हैव टू फर्स्ट रन द मेन टेबिल सिलेक्ट स्टार फ्रॉम एम्प्लॉय एम्प्लॉय टेबिल एम्प्लॉय टेबिल सो यर यू कैन सी दैट सो इफ आई रन बोथ द टेबिल सो इफ आई इंक्रीज द लेंथ सो हेयर यू कैन सी इफ आई ज्वाइन विद द न्यू आई डी विद द मेन टेबिल आई डी करेक्ट सो इफ आई सो हेयर यू कैन सी दिस आई डी आर डी रिकॉर्ड आर फॉर द सी टी आउटपुट इफ आई ज्वाइन विथ न्यू आई डी टू ज्वाइन विथ दिस टू सो आई विल गेट द दिस आई टी आई विल ज्वाइन विथ दिस न्यू आई डी आई डी वन ज्वाइन विथ दिस आई डी सो आई विल गेट द डिपार्टमेंट ओके सो आई विल शो यू सो आई हैव टू मेक एस वन मोर सी टी सी टी वन एस I have to use select from CT one. I have to give alias C. I have to use inner join, inner join employee, employee alias E on C dot new ID equals to E dot ID. I have to take the all the columns. So if I run this query, so here you can see that I will get the This is my CT output. This one, and this one is the employee table main table uh, output. Correct. So here you can see the new ID join with this ID. One join with the. So here you can see all the new ID join with ID. Okay. Uh, example C dot ID C dot ID. This column I will take the C dot name C dot name. I will take the C dot department. This is my uh, before swap department. So I have to use C dot Department. I have to give as alias before swap. Before swap, I will take that this department. I will take as a after swap. So I have to use e dot department as as after swap. So if I run this query, I will get the expected output. So here you can see that I have to increase. So here you can see that before is the This is my uh, employee table. Employee table ID one name John department is the cell. So employee ID one name John before swap department is the uh, sales and after swap two becomes ID. So here you can say I'll get the ID. So employee ID two uh, Tom department ID employee ID two Tom ID before swapping is the ID and after swap I'll get the sales for the employee ID for the employee ID seven seven Shivani are there. Name Shivani and department is the ID. So before swipe is the ID and after swipe also ID. So I hope you understand this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you visit this channel first time, please subscribe this channel. We'll meet again. Goodbye.